Hi there lad, today we're gonna speak about medium price electronics review from now on. Alright, so let's get started. We're going to get a once in a lifetime opportunity to join the party too. No catch, no money, no skills required. <laughs> Again, our next episode today. Okay. We're gonna get a deal from now on. We're gonna equip our lab electronics stuff. So let's get crack on. All right. First, we're gonna open the thingy. As you can see, it's got this stuff. This is now boring thingy. Let's see what we got because we order some new stuff from now on so let's see what do we have here lots of packaging all right then interesting what says on the package contact yescom usa inc so united states but the main thing itself which is this one Alrighty then. Let's remove this stuff. This one can be used later on. They are glued. They're kind of glued together. Okie dokie. Even this sealable bag is useful. Nice and beauty. This one is kind of small, but nonetheless, it's small and it's quite hefty, man. It's quite all right. We got a little bit thingy there. Display DC power supply QWMS305D. As you can see here, fine power on a metal plate in between those. Why the fuck is this? Let's see. What? Why is the metal plate? <coughs> it's got a metal plate in between this stuff. We have to read the manual to see what's going on. But this is the thing. Are you ready? It's gonna be the first test. All right. So. Before you're gonna start playing with this one, you should play the manual. It says here the very important thing do not connect any load to the power supply before it's turned on. So do not connect it now. And as well, uh, make sure to disconnect the load before shutting down the power supply. Can damage this one and your load as well. Or also keep that one in mind. This one is a, a standard 200 240 volts so it doesn't have the adjustable knob for 110 so but this is just a feature as you can see this one is a little bit bent but we're gonna connect the the plug straight away which is kind of wobbly as you can see but we're gonna adjust it later on so we have this one this plugged is it what in you get for this is the power supply. All right, then we're gonna take this the, is all the stuff that you're gonna receive, the leads, which and we're gonna test later stuff. on. You see, we're gonna all right. Looks change okay. them or they're okay. quite big. Mm. We're gonna see it on actually test. Have, have decent, let's say the least. All right, let's plug the minus to minus and plus to plus. This is kind of. Mm. And then that this one is wobbling. Mm. Let's see. He's alright, kinda. Okay, ducky. We have the power supply here. We're gonna plug the bastard straight away in. We're gonna put the leads separate. Like kind of so. And fingers crossed. Let's power it in. Nothing happens. What the fuck? What the hell? Nothing? Set the maximum. Hmm. 
not a good start, ain't it? Fucking hell. Bastards. Uh, let's remove the keyboard and check the fuse to see if there's something wrong with the fuse already. Fucking hell. Let's see if something is wrong with the fuse. Already, man. Fucking hell. Bastard. Okay, multimeter in the continuity test. We will just check this fuse. The fuse is alright. Hmm. Alright, let's bring another cable and we're gonna fix it later on. Okay, okay. We have another cable. I'm gonna plug it in and see if this one is gonna work. The original one was dodgy. So. Let's see. Ah, come on, fingers crossed. And okay, now working. How about that? <coughs> the knob is all the way to the maximum, so 31.9. The fan is already working. When I'm the fan kicks in around 16, 17 volts. So we're gonna take it all the way to the minimum. 2.6 let's see this one this is the max no. uh -huh. so we just finesse pick 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 what the fuck that means let's see let's adjust the finesse uh -huh. <laughs> So you can go 0 0.1 Let's see like this Let's put it 1 volt Nope Come on, 1 Let's measure to see if 1 is equal to 1 Let's bring the multimeter Put it into volts And let's check this one So plus and minus one point there you go 12 this is not accurate as well let's try to adjust it 1.2 7 hey let's get minimum maximum thingy all right then so you got the idea here is the course the um <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.